Hi and welcome to Cardpress. In this video tutorial, I will explain to you how to add and edit records inside Edit View. I'll use the Cardpress employee business card to exemplify the functionalities of Edit View. Let's start by clicking on the Open button. Then click on the Cardpress business card. Now click on My Name on the card. On the Source tab, change the title to Name, like this. Then, on the updated menu, choose Edit View option. Now, click on the Position field and do the same procedure. Change the title to Position and then the updated option, change it to Edit View. And finally, click on Contacts field and proceed the same way. Change the title and update it. OK, now click anywhere on the screen, like this. As you can see, you have a new tab, Edit View tab. Notice that the fields are not by entering order, but we can position them as we like. Just drag and drop, like this. Simple, isn't it? Now we have the first record on Edit View, so let's add some more. To start, click on the Insert Record button, and on the Name field, Add the new name, like this. Do the same to the other fields and records. The procedure is exactly the same. Now let's wait a moment while the records are fulfilled. OK, now we have the five records and our edit view look like this. Use the scroll buttons to see other records. But it's still missing one important object on our card. That's image photo. And that will be our next step. To do that, click on the Browse Image button. Position the image here. And then choose the image from the browser, like this. Then the procedure is the same. Change the field name to Photo, for example. And change Updated to Edit View. Now, we have an image field on our card records. The next step will be add the image photo to the other records. Go to the next record, double click on the photo area on the Edit View tab and then choose the next image photo from the browser, like this, and repeat the procedure to the other records. Let's wait a moment while the photos are added to the records. OK, now we have all five records saved on a single file with the card settings. And we did all this without any database knowledge needed. Simple, isn't it? Like everything else in Cardpresso. Now, it's time to save our work by pressing the Save button. On the next tutorial, I'll teach you how to print your cards from the Edit View. See you on the next tutorial. Thank you for choosing Cardpresso and goodbye.